Hey guys, so I've got this laptop. It's a HP 15 laptop, and I just kind of wanted to show you what I did here too. Uh, I rigged up an external button, which there's going to be a button on the end of this when I get done, and I'll show you in the video. But this dude would not power on no matter what I did. So um, I was thinking maybe the switch that's underneath here was bad. So I ordered another switch and it still would not power on. So I don't know what was going on. Something in here in the power input of the motherboard was just not receiving signal from the switch properly. So I thought, man, you know what? I'm just gonna hotwire this dude. Um, so, and I wish I would have got this on video before um, I'd already finished, but I finished and I was like, I'm gonna put this on YouTube. So I just, you know, ran some little speaker wire in here into the jumper and soldered those dudes on the pins. Um, of course I wrapped them with electrical tape and I got this to kind of secure it from moving around and I put a little dab of hot glue on there to secure the, the sorry, the phone ring to secure the, uh, the joint on there really good. And now whenever I take my two cables at the other end, and I just touch them together, it'll fire that dude right up. So let me show you. I'm gonna plug it in. Hopefully I don't get electrocuted in the process here. As you can see, there's the light. And let's see if I can... <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> trying to do this and hold the... Oh, let me come back here, dude. Come back here. All right. So now. You get it to touch. Oop, there it went. See, there's my light. So now the laptop is booting up. I want to touch two wires together. And I just went to O'Reilly's. And I got this little vehicle push button switch deal here. And I'm just going to solder the other ends of those wires onto that. And when you push that button, this dude's going to fire right up. So basically, same deal as hot wiring a car. You just hot wire this motherboard. Um, and I'll come back with another video whenever I get it completed and let you see. But this was a, a very fun and interesting project. I learned a few things and, um, yeah. So if you have a problem with your laptop not coming on and the switch is not fixing the problem, just hotwire that dude and you should be good to go. All right, guys, so I've got this little button rigged up, as you can see. I've got the wires coming out of the side of the laptop. It's plugged on. And this button right here does absolutely nothing. It is completely just there for looks, <laughs> if you will. Now, check this out. I push this little button right here. Yeah, I didn't push it hard enough. There we go. Ain't that pretty crazy? And that is how you hotwire an external button up to a laptop. Hey, so I wanted to get back on and kind of show the end result. Uh, as you can see, this is just a little push button switch thing here. And here are the wires running from the motherboard out the side of the laptop. And they run up and around here. And I just kind of connect them together because the wires weren't quite long enough when I opened the lid. So I tied on some more wires and just hot glued the wires here and hot glued the button there. And it's, that dude is stuck. So I just have some electrical tape around here, but I want to show you. So I'm going to open the laptop and as you can see it is completely dead 
This button right here does absolutely nothing. It's just a dead button. But when I push the button right here, and it is on. Awesome. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.